the warden was was a great, uh, he articulated very well what we call the classical school of criminology, and that's that if we subject you to miserable treatment, you'll change your behavior. Um, unfortunately, that's not what science and research shows. If we subject you to really bad treatment, you end up actually becoming even a, a worse individual. Um, and so with the commission, how do we reduce the prison population safely? Part of it is not sending people to prison that aren't best served or don't need to be incarcerated. So um, I do remember the one character's name was, was it Queenie? It was. Um, I think he said he was in prison for weed. So I assume that it was the height of the, the new laws that had to do with the illegal uh, the, the making, making cannabis a, a criminal offense. Um, Pam's agency works a lot with trying to divert people from the correctional system when they have a substance abuse disorder. Um, in the 1980s and 1990s, um, we describe the drug user as the person that will knife their mother for not a beer, but for some crack or for, for some drugs. And that fueled an appetite in the, in the public for, well, let's be punitive. Let's subject them to some bad conditions, and that will change their behavior. Um, that isn't the way it will change people's behavior. So the commission's uh, efforts were to make people aware of that, but also to make sure that our laws reflect what our values are and what crimes we think really are deserving of this expensive and severe form of, of punishment.